Don't you hate it when your kids skin their knees? I know I totally do. And what I did is I created some knee pads that you can insert into your toddler's or your child's old pair of pants. So what you'll need is of course a few pairs of old pants, some paper to make the pattern if you'd like, some fun foam. I like to use this type of foam and as opposed to fabric foam because it doesn't retain water. And this one has a sticky back but you don't have to get it with the sticky back. Spray adhesive that's good for fabric and some scissors. Scissors I know. <laughs> So as you can see I have these old pair of pants and I figured out where the knees are. So I'm just going to take a piece of paper and create a pattern to use. So I'm just kind of eyeballing it, you know, I'm a mom and I don't really have time to really get 100% precise. Besides this is going to be in the back part of the pants or on the inside so you won't really be able to see it. So once you have the pattern that you want, then you can go ahead and cut that out and you can use that for all of the knees or the knee pads. And here you can see I'm tracing it and then flipping it over and tracing it on the other side over the foam. And it doesn't have to be perfect. Then I'm cutting out my two knee pads. There they are. Now I flipped it inside out and I'm going to be taking the sticky part apart from the paper and using my spray adhesive I'm going to go ahead and spray it on the pants. As you can see I have a piece of paper under the pants so it doesn't get on my surface, my work surface. Then I sprayed a little bit more on the padding and I'm joining them together. Then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side making sure that I move my paper over so I don't spray my workspace and I'm going to take the sticky part off and then spray the spray adhesive on this back part as well. This stuff gets really really sticky so be careful. You can wear gloves if you want but it's not really necessary. You can wash it off after. I stuck my hand inside the pant leg just to make sure that it didn't stick to each other and you want to wait about an hour for a permanent bond. Here's an old pair of pants that I have actually inserted knee pads on and I wanted to show you that I have washed these. Um, you can't put them in the dryer, you have to let them air dry, but you can see here that it doesn't come off. It completely stays and these have been worn for the past two or three months. They're pretty awesome. Now here are some green pants and I'm just showing you that I'm using green and it doesn't really matter because you can't even see it. But And then here's the other pair of pants. Um, I put everything away just to show you guys that I do recycle the other pieces which I will use later along with my two little patterns and here they are after an hour you can see what they look like and you can't even really see the knee pad I mean these are play pants they're not meant to be worn like to school or anything like that although if you want to send them to school with these that's okay you can't even really see it it's like barely there. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this and that this does help you out because it doesn't matter whether you have a little girl or a little boy. They are always on their knees playing and the last thing you want is for them to get their knees skinned. So put them away all together and you'll always have your play pants for your kids. Hope you enjoyed.